George Sender, the guy from Pittsburgh. And only the names haven't been changed to protect the innocent. Yes, we have a new creepy conspiracy here. And I'll show you the picture of this woman. Chloe Goines. Well, you can't see it. God, I wish I could put this stuff in my... Um, this is the a bimbo of the month here, a dancer. She goes to the Playboy Mansion in 2008. She goes to the LADA and says, I want to file charges against Hef, Hugh Hefner, and Cos, Bill Cosby. And the DA says, no, nope, not going to do that. Then she goes to federal court. She kicks it up a notch and dismisses her own case in February. Now she's filed a civil lawsuit. And she alleged that she had a creepy encounter with Bill Cosby and Hefner was part of conspiracy that made it all possible. Now, she can't get criminal charges, but she can sue civilly. But her lawyer says, we didn't go away. We didn't want to publicize what we're doing. Well, what do you think you're doing? You're publicizing it, aren't you? And... <laughs> I love people that we don't want to publicize it, but they do a press conference. So go figure that one out, folks. Uh, that sounds like publicity to me. So um, here they go. They don't want to publicize it, and they're publicizing it. We found additional evidence we felt pointed toward Hefner being complicit. Well, I, the news story I'm reading over the New York Daily News, what evidence? Well, here's the thing. Her attorney goes, we thought it was more judicious to file in state court. We'd have more leeway with respect to discovery. What the hell did they discover? Says nothing in here. Mr. Hefner is 90 years old. We're suing him for what he's done in his 30 years. He was friends with Bill Cosby. So now it's a crime to be friends with Bill Cosby. It doesn't make us happy. He shouldn't get away with he shouldn't get away with being held accountable for being complicit. And Goins is behind the new complaint. She was disappointed when L.A. authorities didn't prosecute. They had a higher standard to meet. Now, in a minute, you'll find out why they didn't prosecute. We feel we'll be able to proceed in a civil action. The new lawsuit alleges sexual battery, gender violence, intentional infliction of emotional distress, negligent infliction of emotional distress, and conspiracy to commit sexual battery. Now, she's 25. She was in diapers when Cos was doing I Spy, okay? She wasn't even existing. She claims, everybody claims this, Cosby spiked her drink. It's the national craze. You go to the Playboy Mansion and you get a chance to get your drink spiked by Bill Cosby at a private party. Well, that's all they got except when have to rent it out for events. They're all private parties at the notorious Pleasure Palace. Hefner suggested she go lie down in the bedroom. She said Cosby took her to a room where she blacked out. So there's Cosby. She blacks out. She wakes up feeling <laughs> a sharp pain in one of her toes. When she awoke, she looks down at her toes and discovered Bill Cosby with one of her toes in her mouth. In his mouth, I'm sorry. She would notice, she noticed. Now, you notice this. I don't know how you just notice this. The word notice puzzles me. When I am in this state of, of, of uh, deshabille, I know <laughs> I'm naked. But she noticed I'm naked. Oh, my God, I'm naked. And she felt a wet and sticky substance on her breast as though a person had been licking them. Now, you know... There's a lot of things that can be wet and sticky. You could have grape jelly, my favorite, strawberry, blueberry, peach, pineapple, uh, pear. <laughs> you could have honey. You could have semen. You could have crazy glue. Who knows what's sticky? But she's got no proof that Cosby was licking her breast and... You know, looking at her picture, 
from what I can see, um, okay, she's somewhat flat-chested by comparison. But, you know, how do you notice all of a sudden I'm naked? I've got sticky stuff on my boobs. And there's a, an old man sucking my toe. Now, you know, the reason why the LADA didn't prosecute this case is because he would have been laughed out of court, not ju just by the judge, but by the jury. Let me, let me get this straight now. Uh, it says the judge, you want to file a charge for felony toe sucking and sticky stuff on the boobs. Y yes, Your Honor. Uh, no, I'm not going to. I'm not going to uh, let that case go to court. Get the hell out of here. So you, you know, I, <laughs> I just don't get this. She goes to the DA. They say, "No, we're not going to file this. We'd be laughed out of court." Goes to federal court, drops the suit. Probably the judge in the federal court said, "You've got to be kidding me. Get the hell out of here." So she, these are assumed for big bucks, but they don't want any publicity. All right, this is the latest Cosme moment. <laughs> I mean, you know, I don't know if Cosby did any of this stuff. There's a prosecutor in Philadelphia, and, you know, he may have other uh, aspirations like higher office that he's pressing the suit against Bill Cosby and has treated his wife terribly, who had nothing to do with this as far, any of this as far as I can figure out. But, um, you know, we're innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. Of course, we've turned around now where you're guilty until proven innocent. That's the way law runs now in a lot of cases. But um, toe sucking and sticky stuff on the boobs. How do you prove that, you know, you were toe sucked? And it's her word against Cosby's and Hefner's. I mean, I don't. I don't see, I can just see this moment. Here's this babe standing there, and Cos goes over to Hef. Hey, man, I got this really hot babe, you know, and I want to suck her toes, Hef. Can you put something in a drink, and I can give it to her so I can suck her toes and put sticky stuff on her boobs and make it look like someone's licking on them? Oh, sure, I'll do that right away. <laughs> yeah. And that's a conspiracy. There's no proof. She didn't say anywhere that she, you know, uh, Cosby, you know, where the drink was, the circumstance of the drink, how the drug was put in the drink to make her get knocked out, how she got naked, and, uh, you know, Cosby could say, I didn't suck her toes. I didn't make her naked. The woman's crazy. She's lying. How do you prove a negative? Uh, you know, how do you prove a, a disprove a negative so this is this is a nutty case the the, the case of the um, toe sucker <laughs> toe sucking cosby all right have a great day this is george send i'll be back in a minute with another video bye bye